This is KRQE News 13 with Dick Niffing and Diane Anderson. One city councilor referred to it as a multi-million dollar mistake. That's the massive BMX facility near Isotopes Park built by the city of Albuquerque in 2006. As we told you in May, nearby residents have so many problems with it, city councilors started considering moving the whole thing. That could cost millions. But as Tim Maestas reports, the mayor's office is trying to come up with a much less expensive alternative. Three years after this massive track opened near Isotopes Park, some hope for neighbors who say there's too much dust and way too much noise. As you can see, we've got a noise wall here. We think that this issue can be resolved with a number of treatments at the facility. The mayor's office responding to several years worth of concerns neighbors described to us back in May. When they're having an event, you can hear all the people screaming. The announcer on the loudspeakers, like, here comes Johnny. It's very confusing as to why it was built back up here next to our house. The bare minimum, as far as I'm concerned, would be a properly designed sound wall. City Council President Isaac Benton says the city made a mistake by modifying the original plan and building the massive facility so close to the homes here. Benton says moving the facility to its original location is still an option. City administrators put the cost at $4.2 million, but an independent analysis commissioned by the council puts the cost at about 1.8 million. We're in really tough economic times right now. Yeah. Should this be a priority, do you think? I, I do believe it's a priority because I believe it's, it's an error that the city made. Councillor Benton says he wants to move quickly to solve the problems at the BMX facility, but he's not ready to propose anything to the full city council just yet. It all depends on what the mayor's office decides. We're going to be doing a noise analysis and a modeling for a noise wall. We can solve this problem with some mitigation measures and not even have to contemplate relocation of a structure. Tim Maestas, KRQE News 13. City administrators will present a cost analysis study to the city council next week. Councillor Benton says he hopes to get some sort of action within the next two months.